You do. said in the script that this budget hands a majority of the cabinet a cheque worth £40,000. How do you work that out? Well, uh, the average uh, top-rate taxpayer um, will save £10,000. Uh, 14,000 millionaires will get um, over £40,000. And the number of millionaires, there's 23 millionaires in this cabinet, uh, out of 29 ministers, yeah. and the majority of those will get up to £40,000. But they don't earn a million pounds a year. Well, it depends on who you're talking There's about. There's no one in the cabinet earning a million pounds a year. So how... Well, what George Osborne so himself... Where would the, the 40000 George, George, you, You're assuming that because you're worth a million pounds, that you get a million pounds a year. This is a tax on income. No one in the cabinet's making a million pounds a year. They may be worth a million and more, but they're not earning a million. These are people... Correct? Well, it depends. So the 40,000 figure's not right? Well, it depends, actually, because a lot of them themselves, in terms of as couples, are earning huge amounts of money. But the fact is they're rich. Well, they'll pay separate tax. If, if we look at the Conservative Party, over half of Conservative funding comes from the city. It is a party which is funded that, that's largely not by my millionaires. Point. I'm, and I'm they simply saying, can you, are you, is it your claim tonight that there are many people in the Cabinet who are, as we speak, earning a million pounds a year? Well, I'd like to see the whole cabinet and all Tory right. MPs, all Tory MPs, come clear about their earnings, okay. um, including. Well, they have to as cabinet ministers, don't they, Alistair Campbell? As a cabinet minister, you have to declare your income. Um, well, I think cabinet minister salaries are, are published. Yeah, but, but you also I, have to declare any other. But, uh, well, I, but that's why I find it very odd today when.